What's up everyone and welcome to the club. In today's video, I'll show you how to draw Miles Morales Spider-Man. Now you want to begin today's lesson in the center of our page with the eyes. Let's leave a small gap in the center. We're going to start over on the left side. Let's draw a curve that goes up towards the top of the eye. And we'll bend that out towards the left. Let's line up the inside over on the right and do the same thing. Going up and then bending that out towards the side. Now to go back to the top left, we're going to draw the bottom of the eye. It's going to curve this down, round out the bottom of the eye, and pull that up and in. Now you want to trace each of the eyes along the inside. So we'll start from the top left, just follow that curve coming all the way down, and then we'll trace the bottom of the eye. Now from here we're going to draw the inside edge of the hood. Let's connect the top corners of the eye with a curve. We're going to go up the middle and then we'll bend that back down. Let's go to the outside the left eye, draw the bottom of the head. We're going to come down, round up the chin, go across and then up on the right. Let's add a fold along the top of the hood. We're going to go up the middle and then bend that back down. From the center of the fold, we're going to draw a seam going up towards the middle. I'm just going to bend this out towards the left, right, and then up towards the middle. Now from here, we're going to work our way down along the left side of the head. Let's curve this down, bend that out, and then bend that back down towards the side. Let's go back up to the top. I'm just going to round this out, go across towards the right, and then bring that down towards the same height. I'm going to bend the hood coming back in towards the body. Let's round out the side, come down, and then in. Let's add a fold along the side. Start from the top, bend this out, and then down. Now from here, we're going to draw the inside edge of the jacket. You need a gap in the center. Let's start over on the left. Draw a straight line coming all the way down towards the hip. Move over towards the right and do the same thing. Let's round out the bottom of the jacket, going out and then up towards the side. And then from here we can go up and then bend that in just underneath the hood. Let's add a trim along the inside. From the hood, we're going to step out, draw another straight line coming all the way down towards the bottom. Let's add a trim along the bottom of the jacket, coming down and then in. From the inside corner of the jacket, let's step up, draw the bottom edge of the belt with a curve. Step up, we'll draw that again. And leave a small gap in the center, draw two lines with the side of the buckle. Now we're going to draw the center of the logo in behind the jack. Let's start from the top with a curve. Going up and then down. Step down and draw that again. Let's go all the way down towards the bottom. Curve down and up. Step up and draw that again. Now we're going to simplify the center of the logo. Starting from the middle, curve up and down towards the left and right. Bend this out and up towards the side. And then from the bottom, bend this up and in, and then we'll round out the center. Let's continue working down towards the bottom of the legs. In the center of the buckle, let's step down and add a curve, going up and then down. Leave a small gap in the center, go to the left side, angle down and out towards the left and right. Let's round out the bottom of the pant. We're going to go out and then bend that up. Now tuck the side leg underneath the jacket, going up with an angled line. Now from the inside corner of the shorts, we'll step out, bend the leg, going out and then down towards the heels. 
Let's round out the bottom of the feet. We'll start on the left. Bend the foot coming down and then up on the outside. Let's go back to the left side. We're gonna draw the top of the foot with a half circle going up. Bend that down, aiming towards the heel. We'll leave a gap on the inside. Now from the outside corner of the shorts, we'll step in, bend the outside leg going out, and then down on top of the feet. Let's add a thick sole along the bottom of the feet. I want to take this curve, step up, and just trace that across on both sides. And then from the top of the foot, curve out and then down towards the sole. And then from the center of that seam, curve up and out. Now from the top of the foot, we're gonna step up and add a curve coming down and up along the top of the shoes. And then from the top of the seam, draw a straight line going up towards that line. Now I'm going to go back up and draw on the arms. Let's start halfway down the side of the body, curve the arm going out and then down towards the wrist. And let's line that up on the right. Now from the wrist, we draw a small half circle coming in and out for the thumb. Close off the end with a bracket. Let's add three fingers on either side. We start from the bottom of the thumb, we come down and then up around that bracket. Step down, go out and up. Now I'm going to add one more finger from the side, go out, bend the arm, go up and in underneath the head. Now let's separate the cuff. Starting from the top of the thumb, go up and then out. Now I'm going to step up and draw that again, coming towards the inside of the arms. Let's finish off by signing our art and adding a splash of color. And that's pretty much it. That's how we draw Miles Morales as Spider-Man. I hope you enjoyed today's lesson. If you did, please make sure you subscribe because I'm posting new lessons every single day. You can also drop your requests in the comments below. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon.